southwest Montana, southwest, south central, and Big Timber, Montana. Small ranch town, about an hour outside of uh, Bozeman. This is a place that I've been coming to for 20 years now, and being able to reconnect with a place that I owe a lot to. Um, and that's everything from the greater concept of Montana to Big Timber itself. We're on currently the back half of what used to be the Hobble Diamond Ranch, which was my dad's ranch. Combination of crazy mountains, Beartooth Mountains, Zorkies. Um, we had Yellowstone River running right through the uh, front section of the ranch. 800 mother cows, 4,000 tons of hay each year, about 50 bulls on the ranch at the same time. Whenever we were here growing up, I was only here during the summertime, so I was never really exposed to the hunting out here that much until I got a little bit older. And then as I started getting more into building out birch barrel and getting this thing going and really getting excited about hunting and elk was sort of, it came with the territory of being in Montana. Hey dad, uh, just wanted to give you a heads up and uh, say that we're gonna go out and try and get on some birds tomorrow morning. There's a couple of ducks and geese before we head to elk camp. Let's meet at my place around 3 a.m. Uh, bring Dewey along and go uh, meet up with Dustin and friend. And then we'll, uh, we'll get on some birds. See you then. Bye. An important part of what we're trying to do is in birch barrel, honestly, get this concept that taking the meat that you harvest and getting it on the grill, and it's all sort of a part of the outdoor experience of what we're trying to encourage people to do with birch barrel. We started doing this because we wanted to build a brand and a product around people who have caught it, killed it, or raised it. So everything from hunters and fishermen to ranchers and farmers. When I say eating our own cooking, it's more a matter of practicing what we preach. So we went out today, hunted all day long, and then decided to throw that elk onto the grill or you know, just come together as buddies and have a good time and celebrate it and not only celebrate the animal but celebrate our day out in Montana hunting and have a good time. Where you're out looking at hundreds of elk at a time and antelope and deer and all that so pretty hard to beat. Montana this is why Bozeman and Big Timber all of it it's why I pick you know this place to call home and why birch barrels here, and it's a pretty incredible place. Birch barrels seemed like the right opportunity to reconnect with a place that I owe a lot to.